Hello and welcome to another update. In this one, we'll be focusing around the Bakhmut front as well as the Luhansk front. So, starting out in the Bakhmut front, the latest update suggests that Russia is advancing further towards Klishchivka from the east, and they are now very close to the city itself. Most of the forces are coming from the eastern flank, but there's also some from the southern flank, so they're doing a two direction pincer maneuver on Klishchivka. However, they have not reached the village yet, as the Ukrainian defensive forces are managing to hold them back so far. As for the Bakhmut front itself, there's a lot of fighting ongoing to the northeast, east and south of the city. Most of the Russian forces are trying to break through the, pre the preliminary defenses of the city and trying to get a foothold within it. However, so far they failed to do so, as the Ukrainian defenders are holding on strong. And finally, around the Solodarsivetsk area, there's a lot of fighting that has started. They are attacking Spirene from two directions, as well as starting an attack on Vechnokamyanske, Bilohorivka in the north, Bilohorivka in the south, as well as Yakovlivka, as the Russians are trying to get the initiative here and advance. Or to my understanding, they are expecting Ukrainian forces to be weaker right, right now, or either that, or to pressure the Ukrainian defenders as they are focusing their defenses around Bakhmut. If most of the defenses go to Bakhmut, then they will not have a lot of reinforcements to send to the Siversk area, as they would all be in Bakhmut, which would leave Siversk with little to no reinforcements. And now finally, at the Luhansk front, there's ongoing fighting both to the north and to the south of the front line, where the Ukrainians are trying to get the initiative here in the north. As the Russians are focusing their attacks in the Siversk and Bakhmut areas, that leaves the Luhansk front uh, less defended and with less reinforcements. And that's it for this update. Thank you all for watching and have a great day.